Hello viewers, indeed it has been quite a while since I've last seen you, but to be honest it's not exactly easy to make videos when you've got a uh, lot of work commitment at school. But anyway, I finally got the chance with the topic of microwave oven transformers and blowing stuff up with what I've got. And for those of you who are curious, I did buy this very nice 33 kilovolt insulator on trade me about a month ago. It's massive. So it'll be very nice and uh, especially safe for any of experiments I do. I uh, got that little motor yesterday from a tip. I'm going to try and get that running sometime. And this is basically how my workshop is so far. Yep, I've got lots of microwave oven transformers. And that's about it. Uh, three microwaves. This one here. And that one over there dead, so I'll show some videos of dismantling them and stuff like that. And um, I'll blow some stuff up in those ones. Okay? Here we are, nice transform in the capacitor, or well, actually, relatively speaking, it's an average size, but hey, something better than nothing. I'll just put this over with my uh, collection for now while we dismantle the other one. One down, one to go. This one's definitely quite a bit bigger. Uh, the other one I think was 800 watts, but this one's 1.2 kilowatts. It says on here, it's quite big and pretty heavy, so I think you should get a good transformer out of it. Well, here we are. Not a bad one. I like the wire, so nice and big. Well, here's our microwave for blowing shit up. It's actually a very nice one. Um, does the job very well. And for you, if you're interested, I'm going to be putting heat sinks in here. Um, a couple of these huge fuses, which I uh, got from circuits of an old train, a decommissioned one. And uh, one moment, light bulbs. Ooh, something interesting at last. Oh. 
And now I'll get a load of that. It's pretty warm in here as well, eh? Well, I have to say, microwave's done its job. I thoroughly enjoyed that. Well, our viewers, thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, please give a thumbs up, because I really appreciate that. And maybe you'll see a couple more videos coming up, depending on my workload. But anyway, um, thanks for watching and we'll see you later.